Okay, so good morning everybody and once again welcome back in today's class. Day number eight and we were discussing about the CSDM model. Okay. So see that yesterday we were discussing about the CSDM model. This one and now we are going to be complete this. From the ITSM perspective from the training perspective from this course agenda perspective. We are not we are we don't need to be go in very much deep of this particular concept because it's on very high level. We will be using it. So we discuss about sell and consume. Now let's go to the second domain which says about the design. OK, and design means Let's say if I am saying in the market that OK, I am a trainer and I'm giving my services. I'm giving training as a services. So to to prove that or to do that, I need something in the background. And this is what is covered under. This side design domain. This is the place where no business person will be there. It's mainly on the enterprise and the application owner. Let's say if we are running a company. I said if anything come for the training, Samira is the. Application owner. If anything need to be changed in the training curriculum, training circle, training lines, training definitions, then Samira is. Application owner and here we have a business capability. Then what happened nowadays that every company is running its own CI COE center of excellence. OK. So how this or what is that basically that is your business capability? That is your business capability. To to show to your customer, yes, I have a capacity. I have a capability. I have a set of people who can help me to work on that part. It's called the designing. And here we have a business capability and business application. Means. In the not in the technical term, but in the business term, what you are selling to your customer. See, training you cannot touch. But it is it is like a logical representation. I am or Samira is leading the training part. Now in 4.0, they introduced a new domain called the build. It was not there earlier. In 3.0, it was not there. In the 4.0, they introduce what they say that how this com complete component or how this complete service will be built. And here they introduce the concept of DevOps and SGLC. Like get a requirement, build, develop, test, and deploy. This is what come here. But what is important for us is this last one. Yeah. For uh, manage technical services. Now if I need to provide training as a service to my customer. I need the servers as well. I need that the technical part as well. Not not I'm not saying the people. Technical part, technical components who are supporting that particular stuff. I'll give one example. Okay. Let's say you want to be start a new company and that is in the finance area. That is called the fintech. Okay. You build a platform. Now you want to integrate that platform with some other platform which provide the payment gateway. Like PTM, APP dash something is there, right? That are the middle layer. Now, if I am a company who are providing you the payment gateway, I came to you. Hey, you can purchase this service from me. Okay. Samira is the owner. Samira says yes. 
let I want to purchase it. But Samira say, hey, do you have the technical capabilities? This is what we are talking. I have a people on the deployment. I have a people from the Java. I have a people from the Oracle because those are the technical service I'm providing. In case anything goes wrong, I will be there. So we have a technical services there, which includes technical service offering. And offering means when you offer a service to the customer in a different different segments like based on the location, based on the geography, based on the availability, based on the charges as well. Like we know that I charge amount to you. And there's a rule. Guys, if you ping me for any question, I will reply you between nine to five only. But if you want, no, no, Atul, I need your help in the midnight as well. Then you have to pay more. If simple, if you need 24 cost seven support from a customer, from a company, you have to pay more. Otherwise, pay less and enjoy. So here, these particular stuff come. And under this, we have a configuration item here. So Joe, the points which we discussed at two days back of the CMDB, it is it is coming here. Dynamic group is coming here. And on the top, we have an application service. Application service means that which environment I am providing. It's a dev, it's a test, or it's a production. This is what this particular model says. Nothing to be worried if you're not understanding more, that's fine. Because in this particular concept, in this particular topic, we have to be not, we want, sorry, we are not interested to be go a deep dive, just a high level. Okay, then what service I'm introduced here? They say that's fine. Now they say, let's understand that these concepts, technical service, business offering, you to English words there. Normal English words there. But how these words are connected with the service now? They must be a table in service now. So what service now says? If you come down, it's, it's a long one, 37 pages. It's but it's very good white paper. Practically, I'm seeing it's very good white paper. Where is this code? Conceptual model. Wait, wait, wait. Because if I go this part, it will take another four or five days for us to be complete. There's a, there's a table I remember that they have given here, which says, when we talk about the, yeah, this one, yes. This is what? That English was saying it's a business capability, but in service now it is which model? Let me, let me show you here. Sorry. Here, if I go here, CSDM, so you can see. Application service offering, business capability, business application, managed technical service. Technical service offering. So what this scre screenshot says to me that the terms which you discuss. In a different different domains, they are related with the different different tables like technical service offering. It is in the table called service offering, but when you put the classification as a technical service, it will work. So like if you go here and search. Service offering like this. This one. So it is going in the table service offering, but when you create a new service offering, you can classify it. Where it is gone. Business criticality. Maybe they don't have a field or I have to bring that field here. Okay, so this is this thing. 
service classification is equal to okay sorry technical service offering we are in the right wrong table no table is right service offering but there is no field for service classification so, good morning uh, atul sorry to interrupt you yeah good morning mara uh, uh, just i'm not sure but uh, I still don't see why we are talking about CSDM. In okay. Why okay. and uh, why we have all these uh, modules? And I, I don't see because uh, I, I know I, I know that it's a new con uh, concept, maybe. Mm -hmm. But um, uh, why we use it? Uh, in which case? In which scenario? Uh, so uh, it's a little bit confusing me. OK, no problem, no problem. Very, very valid question that it's confusing and it must be confusing for you. OK, number one, why we have included because it is part of our course agenda to understand. Now the question come why we are using it. That is the second point. OK. Yeah. Earlier what happened that if you. Um, OK, let let me show you here. Earlier, what happened? We were only discussing about the CMDB. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Now, okay, let, let me take an example. Let's say in your home, you say guys or you, you say your parents, let's say four or five members are there. Mm -hmm. You say from today onwards, I'll make a food for everybody in the evening. Mm -hmm. Okay. Things were mm -hmm. going well. You are able to make a good food. Your parents were happy. Your family members were happy. But after some time, someone start complaining. Farah, mm -hmm. you take care of your mom better than me. What she need, you make it. You make for her. Then your brother say, no, no, no. Farah, you take care father and more than me. What she say, you mm -hmm. make for him. Mm -hmm. It means people start complaining. Mm -hmm. That you are giving good service to that person, not to me. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. To, to overcome this problem, you say, OK, let me do one thing. Let me sell this thing to you as a service. Like night food or dinner as a service I'm selling to you. And mm -hmm. it is equal for or it is like a same model for everybody. If you mm -hmm. want two dishes you have to be request in advance if you want the dishes in the midnight as well then you have to be take care of myself more like 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 brother and sister brother says hey can you make it this thing for me then what sister say okay get a glass of water for me i'll do it for you this thing <laughs> it's like a favoring part so when so this is a small example, but when you come to the industry part, single department is giving the services to the multiple departments. Mm -hmm. One department is very much happy, but other department is not happy. Where mm -hmm. the department who is giving the service is doing the everything right for all the departments. Then this question, then this problem came. How to do the reporting? Because if finance is not happy with my services, my services value is going down where HR is happy. Mm -hmm. So they are saying that let's sell everything as a service. And then these concepts come into the picture. Now what you're selling in the market. Now if I say OK, Farah is my service now consultant. You're selling your consulting services in the market to get a job, right? Yeah. Now to get that job, to get the skill, you have a capability in yourself. Yes, I know this thing. I know this thing. I know this thing. I know this thing. Mm -hmm. To get that capability, you are every time you are learning, learning and improving, learning and improving. That is called a build. Mm -hmm. But to, what to build? You have a technical services. You have a knowledge of a JavaScript as well. You have a knowledge of Java as well. You have a knowledge of Oracle as well. 
you are still doing the same thing. <clears throat> CMDB is still same for you. But now you are selling your services as a technical as well as functional as well. So mm -hmm. this is what the concept of CSGM come into the picture. Mm -hmm. Because the first word which is important is called the services. Common service data model. Mm -hmm. Now I, I am an IT service provider. Mm -hmm. I deal or I work with a lot of customers. Pharmaceutical, mm -hmm. telecom, banking, insurance, finance, motor vehicles or automobiles, manufacturing. Retail. Now, if I want to implement service now for all these customers, I cannot create a multiple models to store their CMDB to store your data. Otherwise, I will go mad to be maintain that. Then service now said, "Don't worry, I am giving a structure. Use this format. Ask your customer, okay, what is your business service?" What is your technical service? What is your business capability? What is application service? And then map them as per these mm. things. Uh, uh, so uh, this model uh, shows us uh, shows us what we need to do uh, to make uh, a good service. Let's say to to provide a good service to the customer. We we have no, to uh, follow no, follow not some good service. It helped me to to maintain their service in a better manner. OK, yes, it's that mm. right. Maintain the server in a better manner. OK, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. because you are storing the data in a better format. Now mm -hmm. I'll give an example like in your country. I'm sure people having a different different skill. Like if something goes wrong in your house, you have to be called to the plumber. Yes, if something goes wrong in your house. You have to be called to that electric guy. If you need to be clean your house, you have to be called call a specific person. Right, but if I if I compare this with the India, it's not like that. Like in UK, if something mm. goes wrong, I have to book an appointment. Mm. Then that person will come after three or four days. Sorry, sir, I was not available. I'm, I'm not available. I'll come after four days. But in India, if you just give a call, person will be there and you can get it fixed. The things can be fixed quickly. This is what the service is because here in your country in UK, they are maintaining the services in a different different format. Mm. But in India, it's like a mix one. No standard. If if I want to be if there's some issue at my house, I'm talking about India, some electricity issue. I give a call to the electrician he will be there in next half an hour he will charge some amount and he will fix all the issues small 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 issues but in your country in uk it's not the case if you're calling a person for a specific work he will do his specific work no extra work they will do mm -hmm, mm -hmm. this is what their services they are be giving mm. okay. Atul, can mm -hmm. i just just good morning can i just try to summarize uh good, my good, good standing on uh, cmdb and uh, csdm right Good. so uh, cmdb right usually we capture the technical uh, aspect of the company side right i mean right. we capture the ci right. information their relationships right. and all right we do so, have so, tables so, so we should be wait 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 okay wrong term okay no technical okay in cmdb we are maintaining the components that provide the services it can be hardware it can be uh -huh. software it can be tangible it can be intangible as well okay so don't specify it's a technical only and cmdb in cmdb there is nothing called the technical it can be infra ci it can uh -huh. be non infra ci no technical okay that is java is a technical oracle is a technical Mm -hmm. so, oh, okay. server is not a technical server mm -hmm. is a component it can be tangible it can be virtual it can be physical mm -hmm. so you are when you are be for mm -hmm. your for you guys understanding when you be summarizing when you be understanding mm -hmm. don't interchange the words as per okay. your wish okay. mm -hmm. changing putting one word as a technical you mm -hmm. make the complete definition wrong wrong okay 
now summarize okay so now if we say then uh, then we'll say that uh, that <clears throat> cmdb stores all the component level information of the cis right or right. okay so component level information about ci right we do have business tables right but usually we do not store we don't use it that much right because the whole focus is more about the component where is located what are the relationships right all of all right. sort of things now adding csdm on top of that is actually focusing more on the business data right so when we are only implementing cmdb we are on the component level we are on the ci level right but with the business data with the csdm model we are adding that additional layer to it where everyone is like compelled because that is how it is it is standardized right we have yes. so like we do have the user data in 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 service now right but because that's like part of the foundation data but right. when we implement csdm we are going more deep, deep down into that user data so now this user data is just not the uh, end user right it, it's going to be the mm. process owners mm. the product owners and the contract managers just just like these users right uh, right so yes so what we are doing is we already have the the cmdb data we have the component level we have the cis we have the asset information but to link it with the business side of the world they have i mean service now has implemented one more layer from the business side just to make sure that we are aligning these component the cis set with the business side as well so business i i'll, I'll not be 100% happy with the word business okay. but instead of it saying it's a services side services side because okay. if you see in the csdm they are only and only saying it's like services technical services. service business capability business service application mm -hmm. service it Correct. means they are saying if you are selling anything in the market uh -huh. it's a service okay. i'll give an example i give you a few examples mm -hmm. like i was reading it's a very old one husband mm -hmm. as a service mm -hmm. writer as a service author as a service database mm -hmm. as a service cook as a service and when we speak about the service mm -hmm. simply it says that you as a customer are not bothering about the cost and the risk i as a service provider is bothering about the same bothering about like, yes like if i take example of the cloud computing correct you say atul i have a uh, i have a some uh, some uh, thing on the cloud correct <clears throat> are you maintaining the cloud mm -hmm. no are you updating the cloud no what are you doing you just I'm go and log it. and you build your correct. application correct correct i need yes. additional storage i'll just reach out to the provider i'll ask for more additional storage without thinking that uh, what are they going to do i'll just pay for that and i yes. use <clears throat> even if i do i'm not sure how much storage i need i'll say that i'll use the model pay as i use right, right. So correct so yeah this is like okay the so the word should be services so, so here they convert everything to the service service right right okay Be because the same the same example let's say the day one we take mm -hmm. are you bother about that atul grover had a good sleep in the last night or not no no correct yeah yeah what do you bother that morning 6 o'clock the class should start and i should proceed further in the next course or the, in the yeah. next uh, agenda item right correct. correct yeah neither neither i am worried Hmm. that you guys have a good food you guys have a good sleep what's your going in the family i don't bother because okay. that's not that's not my area i'm selling you this as a service mm -hmm. up to you your consuming or not that's not matter to me my work is to sell out to you correct to correct. correct got that yes okay yes. so <clears throat> so for now we have to be little bit understand from the industry perspective as well things are getting changed Mm. I we are just worried about the CMDB. CMDB is still a important part here mm -hmm. because if something goes wrong in the CMDB, it will have a complete impact on the service level. Mm -hmm. So CMDB is still there, but now in the CSM it is very minimized. But also, so if you have a good CSM, make sure you have a good CMDB model as well. because they are not they are not two separate things they are child of two parents if they work separated the family will be destroyed if they work together the family will be succeed always so they are kind of married to the each other even though they are parent but they are still married to the each married to the 
each other. And we're understanding that how this model has been built up. The reason I'm saying that as per as per my course agenda, it's not to be go very deep dive. So we have to just understand, OK, which table is mapped to which particular component? So if you see here, this is a conceptual model. This is a physical model. That Atul, you are saying technical service, but where have to be stored the technical service under this table? Business capability under this table you can store. Cust your customer need to be bring the data in the service now. Okay, you so boss, this is that this is this is what I am bringing for you. Okay, that's fine. But where are you going to be stored? These are the tables I'm going to be use it. Now, be because one more thing, if you remember in the founding principle, they say standard definitions. Out of the box table. This is what service now say that this is what I'm providing you. Use only these table. Don't bring your own table. And same manner, they say the relationship as well. That how the two component must be interrelated. If my wife delivered a baby, then I will be called as a father. I cannot be called as a uncle because this is not as per the standard relationship. So service now said, don't worry, I'm giving you that part as well. This is what the this is what I can say the the founding principle standardization they are doing now. Because in the CMDB, you can link any CA with any CA with any relationship, which is the problem. I I am telling you. I work with a customer who link the bottom level network with the application directly. No middle layer. Come on, that's not good. That's not a good practice. That's not a good practice. When the kid is starting in or moving to the age six months, one year, we as a parent start helping kid to call okay mama papa uncle auntie why is, why are why are teaching to mummy and papa because you know that this is what the relationship is between you and that kid why you not call yourself as the auntie in front of your child because that's not a relationship this is what service now gave to me and it is not and it in it is coming from the founding principle only. This is if you if you see the word data model, this is what the data model and how this data model has been linked. It is here that a business capability provided by the business application only. Business capability provided by the business service. Business application contain the SGLC component. Now here your infra CIC. Application run on the infra CI. No other relationship recommended with the application and the infra CI. No other relationship recommended by service now. If you are creating any other relationship, you are violating the founding principle of CSGM. And it happens a lot of time. When we were building this model for our one of customer, we do some here and there. And then we discuss the service now. This strictly says if you are violating this principle, you are violating these standards, we cannot help you much. If you drive in the wrong side, nobody can help you or nobody can save you from the accident. It will happen not today, tomorrow, but it will happen sure. Because you're not following the standard things. This is what it's here. So this table says that how these components, you can see these lines are going right. How these components interrelated with this relationship. Now if I come here. And let me. Um, let me see. Do, uh, do I have something? Let's say technical service offering. These are my technical service offering. Let's say firewall is a technical service offering. Hmm. 
no there is nothing called any any kind of a relationship here but we can build so you can see little data nothing is showing there no dependency graph or maybe something see it's blank only but if you open something good then you will find let me find out something good business service offering so like this business business service offering personal printing print shop services nothing is there i'm sure nothing is there but if it is there you should use only these relationship factor nothing else you need to be use not recommended by service now not recommended by contains usability list kind of things only see dynamic say group can use the use the related list no direct relationship it's a reference to one these are the direct one business service often should be parent and that's depend on the application service this is what it says now if you want to implement sir itsm then how you can do this part right so so it is not number one point it is not a one day or two day job it is a bigger job it it take months and years to get it implemented and this is what i am saying from the experience perspective guys this is what i am saying from the experience perspective believe me it took more than 6 month to 9 months just to build the model of csgm for our customer where we use only three or four business services and three or four technical services and the application services to build that how it will be look like because that was too complicated client for us so just to done a poc it takes 6 to 9 months then service now say if you want to migrating not migrating but if you want to be implement csgm because it's not a code it is a framework you have to be implement like every parent wants that their child should be bright should be healthy should be good in the studies and if you start telling to your child child that hey you are very bright it will not work you have to follow some steps give him a time to get up early in the morning go some walk or have some sunlight go to school have a good food healthy food no junk food come home take rest play then study then take dinner on the time and then sleep and all these steps you will not start on the day one you will go one by one by one by one this is what service now say if you want to migrate then you have to be do these five step first export the data in the excel then start matching it let's say i am on the 2.0 and coming to 3.0 or i am 3.0 coming to the 4.0 then you have to do these steps and again this is not going to be completed in the day one or day two it's a weeks and months job getting the data in the table and understanding the attributes which are coming need to be get the script how to update this data because in 3.0 less tables were there in 4.0 more table has been introduced by service now in 5.0 few more table are introduced by service now every time you have to be go one by up 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 and up level so you have to be follow these steps practically what we discuss as of now in our discussion regarding cmdb nothing much is is coming in the examination but it's required to understand 
नाउ द क्वेश्चन कम अतुल ठीक है ये तो हो गया वेयर आई कैन सी दिस सी एस डी एम इन माई सर्विस ना अदर देन दिस टेबल दिस टेबल जो हमने देखा प्रैक्टिकल यूज वेर इज द प्रैक्टिकल यूसेज ऑफ दिस वन सो इफ यू गो हेयर एंड ओपन एनी इंसिडेंट ओके लेट मी ओपन this is your csdm why because earlier what happened that i have only configuration item in my table sorry in my in my form now i have a service and service offering as well to understand that if this ci will not work or not uh, get, uh, this is not get resolved it has direct impact on my service and service offering as well means my client client will start crying hey it is not working it is not working it is not working if i remove these two fields there is no way to understand that how my incident is going to be better other services so let's see if i put something here i'm sure if i get something good and i open the sorry sorry just one question oh, go here ahead, go, go ahead okay good good so we go ahead okay no so i just wanted to uh, say usually uh, when i mean when csdm model is not implemented right and we create an incident so it always i'm seen most of the cases it is the impacted service and ci that we fill in on an incident right. form page right? right so that impacted service is again from the csdm or it is from this from from cmdb only it's um i can say it was from cmdb earlier but mm -hmm. now it has a linking with the service csdm as well okay so on this form right that you are showing we have like service service offering right uh, and impacted service if you also add right so that is just like the service the same field or is it going to be a different one see it, it is say impacted services and the ci uh huh services they say it and slash ci means under this anything can be come either service can come either ci can come right 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 okay what is the difference between affected and impacted then and why there is a two related list are there right so ci is the main one uh, the main ci which is uh, which is getting impacted right so impact yeah. and effect so impact is the word if if i am hurt i am the one who is hurt right now because i am hurt there will be impact right like the 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 i am cooking food i am doing my office work so these are the services that's going to get affected uh, sorry impacted now affected is is something which is related to me which is not directly affect impacting them but they will be affected like my child because she is dependent on me so that is the affected one my husband will be affected right my maybe reporting manager will get affected because i am if i am not working he has to do the additional work so impacted oh. is the one who is directly uh, has the effect on an an affected is something which is like indirectly like the secondary uh, ways which is okay. impacted good good so so now there's a there's a properties which are be running which bringing this data for us but for us to understand that where this csdm exists so it is there service and service offering and if i open any change record in the change also we have the same thing service offering and service and configuration okay and if i go to the problem same thing will be there so i i can understand maybe for i is feeling not feeling much happy by seeing this concept the only thing is that when you start implementing it when you start when your customer start using it you will get a more deep dive in this area it's all about that how you are selling and how you are maintaining these things in your system this is what the csdm says here right and this csdm doesn't come as a plugin right it is no. uh, part of the uh, it's out of the box it is out of the box 
okay. but okay you you pick up the right example mm. practically it's not a right answer anything which you are able to see here mm -hmm. even this problem mm -hmm. it is coming from the plugin do you know yes 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 then csgm also a plugin but it is coming as a pre installed for in us pdi so we are thinking it's not a plugin correct even change management is coming from the plugin only yeah you 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 explained that i mean the when i had the question right you said when we purchase yes. something so service now enable these plugins as part of the like the basic a package right. that they give it to us right so it's there but for us we are not enabling we are not paying extra for these plugins right so that is why for us it's like not the enabling box. it it's coming as out of the box for out us out of the box correct yeah so let's say if i go here csgm see csgm support and all things yeah yeah, yeah. csgm activation kind of things so it means it is the if i go here as a for change management it is there yeah all all coming under e plugins correct correct right see the only thing is that we did not activate this hmm. we're just using it because it's coming in our instance okay so with this we have completed our csgm part let me come back here to the participant fara prashanti and samira any doubt any question fara has <laughs> fara go ahead any question no uh actually i don't know i don't have specific uh question but maybe i should do some documentation uh, to to go uh, in more detail to have to get more details in order mm -hmm. to uh, at least okay the concept is is clear uh, okay um, but uh, okay uh, it needs maybe um, more documentations for me to to understand more yeah right okay. so so what is the best documentation don't go anywhere go to google and download this white paper mhm mm that yeah. is the 100% source of truth for everybody okay. as of now i am following mm -hmm. this document for for a lot of things if i stuck some in the csgm i open this document first of all and see what service now required in this area and moreover it is important to understand this model i know that when you took uh, or you attended my second batch that time i did not have this concept in the picture even i was not aware about this concept this here every word has a specific meaning and once you get the specific meaning it is easy for you as of now what is i am saying business service offering you are saying okay business service offering i am saying business application you are saying okay business application but what this mean to the business like someone says okay i have paid for an interview okay it's more than 4 or 5 years back so it was for the service no pre sales that person opened the interview he was very very senior person in that company he opened the interview and he asked me one question or the first question atul i am hiring if i hire you for the pre sales how you define your job to your wife and you will not believe that i was not able to answer that completely which satisfy his thoughts because what i think as a pre sales is something different and what he think about the pre sales is something different this is what is happening now for me it's clear what is business service but for you it is just a english word business and service you don't know or you are not or you do, no i'm not saying that it's your fault but the basic definition of business service is not clear so if you want to be go in deep dive you have to be understand this model i am telling you every single term here has a specific meaning why business service is here why business service is not here because application service and the business service are the two different component 
in CSDM. Business service, what you're selling to your customer. Application service, which environment you're supporting for a customer. Are you supporting production? Are you supporting dev? Are you supporting QA? Are you supporting test? This is what this says. The best example. Let's say there's a there's a show. There's a play in a theater. OK, sometimes we hire a few guys to support us on that event day. They are not supporting me in the previous days in the rehearsal time. But they're supporting me in the event day. Makeup, costumes, light, sound, everything they're supporting. This is what the production environment. And this sold their service. Yes, we are selling theater support as a service. You need, if you need me in rehearsal as well, I can do. If you need me in the production, I can do. You need me on the some planning, I can do. But for every environment, it's depend. For the production, I am available two hours before till the two hours end of the this your program. But that is the offering. But if you need a, if you need a rehearsal, I will available only on the time and will go. No extra time will be given. That is offering for the rehearsal level. So this is what the application service. To do this part, I will bring a cameraman. I will bring a sound guy. I will bring a makeup man. This is my technical services. Service offering, technical service offering. What you need? Mixing, I can provide you. Makeup, multiple makeups for a single person in a 20 minutes interval, I can provide you. Now, I'll bring all the makeup kit as well with me. Starting from all this foundation, color, lashes, all the things I'll bring it with me. This is what my CMDB. If foundation is not good. And that puts some allergy on the face. You can now imagine that how it is going to be impact the complete show. This is what the benefit of the CSGM. Which was not available earlier. I as a makeup guy did a makeup for an artist. I use a foundation maybe of a lower quality, maybe expired. I didn't tell to anybody. I put on the face. I did the makeup after seven, five minutes. That person start complaining. Hey, I'm finding, finding some itching. And suddenly his face is becoming red. So now if this component get down, you can imagine that what services is failing now. Your complete show is going down. He's a main lead rule for me. This is what the benefit of the this thing. Then the honor of that show complaint about my services. Due to you, I am facing some issues. My technical services are going bad. One component down and impact the complete life cycle. I hope with this example you are able to understand that how these things has been built up and now how this person build this particular person miss the 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 guy who is supporting in that as a service. They say. Yes, I have a capability. I have a song. I have a sound guy. I have a makeup guy. I have a camera. Guy, I have a light guys as well. I have a people in with me. Don't worry. We have our own studio. This is what the, the building part they are saying. We build up the lights. You just give me the contrast. You just give me the thing. I'll read it for you. This is what the build part. But I will support only in the production day, not any other day. If you want any other day, no problem. Take my other service, pay me accordingly. For production, 5000 for daily, 3000 for daily for two hours. This is what the CSGM, how he's selling a service and how we are able to see that one component goes wrong. Has a complete impact or we can see the dependency from there. 
if this makeup has been happened on the rehearsal day still we can find out that why this be happening now it happened on the production day there is no choice left either change the artist not a possible case either there is a risk and go with the same artist only okay clear everybody now fala now now mm -hmm. the fundamental get clear yes yes thank you thank you okay so now what we will do what is with this we have done our configuration management complete concept this is the first base module which we have to be complete before we start for the incident or the change or the core modules i will not proceed further now we will pick up the knowledge management tomorrow a small one easy one but yes need a good attention as well Okay. Anybody has any last question before I stop the recording here? Prashanti, Surbhi, Samira, and Farah. No, I am. I am good. Yeah. No. Oh, good. Okay. Chale. Let me stop the recording then. We'll take a quick attendance.